this week, you'll get to you'll get to say what you think about newly drawn maps that cuts the number of Metro Council seats in half. The maps were released Friday, two weeks after Governor Lee signed this new law. Cole Johnson's joining us live with more and Cole. There are going to be a handful of meetings about this though, right? Good morning, Ben. That's right. There's going to be five of them where you can see these two maps and you can actually weigh in on them. The first meeting is going to be happening today at the Hadley Park Community Center. And again, there are going to be a handful of those and we'll be listing all of those meetings online at newschannel5.com. But they'll be following that new law slashing council in half. And while there are two redistricting map options, they might not end up being used as there's a lawsuit against the state in the works. But let's focus on the now. The two maps are just a bit different, mixing up the numbers of at large and citywide council seats. One is three at large seats, the other is five, which is what we currently have. And there is concern for some that this could shrink diversity, turning majority black districts into larger majority white districts. Also, we'll put current mounts of council members against each other if these maps become a reality. And you do have a large window to go to one of these meetings today. It's from 1030 to 730 again at the Hadley Park Community Center. Back to you in the studio.